to stop him. Finally gonna find a little bit of contact and it's device to take the headshot. Ziwoo's waiting back inside of the doors, but it is a man advantage for Astralis. However temporary it may be. Ziwoo bailing out of the doorway. Dupree and RPK exchanging a couple of kills here. They've got the T's down to only two. They found their bomb plant, but can they hang on to it? Nevera back here behind the boxes, gets iced out by Magis pretty damn quick. And Ziwoo's gonna find nothing. It's Astralis with a retake in the pistol. Thank God we got something. Uh, <clears throat> that was just such an anomaly of a map. I did not anticipate that we would see. They're not gonna go up cat, are they? Actually, we'll run back now. They'll get chased down. And the damage is there. Zipix, when he's up in this position, the protocols that happened after he died completely illuminated what Astralis are really able to do on this map. The amount of nades that came through, the pushes that ensued, they had an answer for everything going into the 5v4. The way they play off of information is something that we have to talk about oh, no. before we do. It is an absolute mode down inside of the B tunnel. Shocks alone, surely bullets are going to come his way. This guy is Neo Yo. in the Matrix, dodging, ducking, and diving, and bending through these bullets, and eventually we'll, we'll get a kill onto the vice. Lucky to have He's relying on support as soon as he hear, hears footsteps. There's no flash just yet. He'll take the duel, and he will lose it straight up. They look to continue around the corners. RPK, he's in mid. Catches the side of Dupree, but gets drawn into Magisk. Three kills for Astralis. And a man advantage off of the back of that. 30 seconds to run. And they're going to head towards top mid. Dupree, he peeks. And he sees both players on the retreat. Ziwu able to throw out the Molotov, hit that shot, but didn't quite catch the kill. And now there's no time. He tried to run, and Glaive not... Not gonna judge it. Let's go into the next round. Apex, spray down on Glaive to start. Coming out, fighting long, not committing to it. RPK in the tunnel, four T's back here. Device answers back with one kill. Ziwu won't be a huge... He's not going to find the kill towards spawn. Shocks has yet to be peaked. Magis pinned in. They get distracted from the car. There it is. Magis with the two kills. Because Device gets Apex. He's got a player to keep eyes on it. Damage goes both ways. Shocks gets Glaive. Device misses the snapshot down. CT now occupied by Apex. Bomb just outside of B. Magis with the two kills. He's the one that shuts down mid and leaves Apex to try and pick up the pieces. But instead, it's Vitality in ta Dives back off the flash. Nevera can't get that headshot quick it. enough, but he does in the end. There's still Dupree, though, and the flashbang's continuous. A little bit too much of a threat, too much heat. RPK taken down. Glaive swing. And Nevera, well, he's going over top of the smoke, looking for an angle deep. Oh! Glaive, he jumps up into it! And a man advantage now for Vitality because Nevera is on for the ace. Apex looking for the bomb plant. That one's easy for the taking. He's looking for the fourth frag as Apex takes down the Catman. It is just Dupree. Full house on the A site for Vitality. Nevera. Out duel Zipix one for one, and they throw the long corner smoke. They call him out in his position. And oh my god, Nevera continues on from that last round. The three frag round, full blind, eyes closed, blindfold on, and hits the long corner shot. Shocks will immediately press out mid, knowing they're in a three long setup. And the B player dies for free. They're going to try to scramble through Shocks. He doesn't need to see. He's got a feel for the game and a feel for Astralis as they try to get out through that CT smoke. Entirely cut down. Not only do we get Vitality onto the scoreboard, but they convert a second round off the back of it with five players alive. And they totally siphoned out the economy here of Astralis. Device absolutely must save to have any hope in this next round. Lost bonus going to favor Vitality. A couple of really confident Rounds one, and Nevera takes out Device. But RPK, he's already out through middle. CT's gonna have to challenge through the spawn. We've got tons of players softened up. Glaive, he doesn't even wait. There's still a T back in CT spawn, but everybody else is dead. Shocks now coming alive, but he's lost his entire team. The rotations are amazing here. Glaive come at Vitality's tempo. That's key. When it's been slow, Vitality have been falling apart slowly. Dupree finds a timing shot on Long. A ridiculous series of events in these last three rounds. It is such a high tempo at the moment. Half of the kill feed's been blind kills, it seems. Players running through smoke. Gunfights out the gates. And no stopping Apex. He just comes trudging down from Long. A second headshot. Nevera's gonna pinch in through the catwalk. Man advantage for Vitality off of the back of that. And Device... 
Well, he goes towards Cat. Oh my Leaves God. Magisk through the CT. A desperate jump across the ramp will get bomb planted. Oh my god, it's just high-level gambles. Like, they go through with that kill and us, and know that Astralis are going to rotate out. They run through long to follow up, get the entries coming into the site. Two CTs here to rate it. Oh my god, Magisk makes it a 2v2. Quick kill. They'll set up a quick flank. Yeah, all their utility out. And Zewu's up to bat. We oh, he threw in the flash, and he can't return the crosshair back on point. But Shox, he made this decision. Where's the plan? And let's see if it pays off. <laughs> Shox with the back-to-back -back headshots. And Vital. For their style of attack on the T side. RPK waits. <laughs> and sure enough, Mad just puts his head right in the middle of the crosshair. That's one of the M4s down. Glaive trying to challenge to the top of middle, but an op keeps him honest. RPK sees. Oh, Dupree. But the Deagle's enough. And just like that, we're back into the four versus four. Apex, he's coming up middle, and there's nobody in tunnels to stop him. So he could take a timing here versus the Catman. Glaive. That's Glaive walking in with the ump out, calls out the position, rushes those final few steps, and that's going to activate the off. Not to mention Ziwu here to take point. Smoke fades, misses the shot. Device, he gets the first one. Almost Ziwu too, and it's nothing but Astralis on the kill feed. That's ten force. You're not going to have players. You know, it's not going to be some kind of lower default. That's enough information to allow them into the round. And Ziwu's pissed off. He just got out dueled by coming in. That's going to bait him forward. Charlie is here to fight. He's going to tuck to the box. Gets the back turned of Shock's Glade. Can't deliver anything other than the first one, but damage is done here to Vitality. Oh, but they can't even go for this. They nope. needed those kills. That was RPK so low. And on his final bull, trying to run up the side of mid. No, that's denied. Vitality keep up once again. Save situation here uh, for. You yep. want to give credit to Vitality for figuring things out. Yes, the score is 10 to 4 at the moment, but in some sense, punch come in from both Long and Cat simultaneously. Apex will get called out. He'll get battered by the Perfect. nade and then hunted down by Zipix. They start crossing. MP9 starts firing through. A grenade that could dunk down. Oh, RPK, a single point of health, but Nevera. Nobody's actually applying pressure or keeping him in position, so he extends into the head of Dupree. Two CTs up from Cat. Final round of the first half. And Vitality, they're walking wounded. RPK goes down and shocks well. He almost gets the double, and it's all on Ziwu. He's dived back behind the car, kept his head down. All three CTs lie ahead of him. He has no utility to work with. They've got kits, but no nades. And it's a trade from Device. An 11th round for Astralis to close out this CT side. We saw that career high performance, but now let's see. Vitality, the only team in the world that could potentially test them. And this is a proving ground for their map pool. They are doing it, but RPK, Letank, is here to stop them. Couple of kills with the USP. Oh, whoop. Zero oh, gets one as he jumps through the sky, but Device, he's got that answer. Somewhere. And they've still got the two smokes available, but Device shows himself. The bomb dives across Zipix. He's going to try to make this a 2v1 if possible. Opportunity shot at and missed. And now he sees them all. Yeah, they're all coming at him. This would take more than just a clutch, right? This is not this is not enough space for him to use. Hides behind box, frag goes out, chips away HP, and the CTs begin to flood in. There are so many bodies outside of the windowsill. Bomb yet to get into the site, really, just sitting on the cusp. Glaive. Oh, his hands are busy, but the pressure's on, and the HP is so low. Yeah, they have tunnels locked down, though. They can all focus forward on the window and the door. This should be a strong spot for the T's. Splattered outside of it. Device, he finds... Skip all of the... They skip all of all of the map control entirely. They start the round out really quickly. And here are some kills in the exits. Both T's will go down, and an upgraded gun will come through for Nevera. Actually, for both of them. Into it. Yeah, it'll be harder for the players than anything else. So let's see what Astralis got for us. Apex up top. Looking super sharp. The flash assist actually comes through, but uh, it doesn't really blind Apex coming. Shock's right around the corner, and no one's in the window just yet. Oh, Ooh. just kidding. It's Ziwu. He appears. Vera okay. finds the headshot through the smoke. Oh, oh, it's not a great smoke. Right. What the hell? As if that's allowed to happen, then Shock's also accurate as ever. They're moving up quite quickly. I wonder if this gets cleared. It falls into it. No way. Doesn't he actually matter. wins that off the, the flash to push him back. Oh, wow. So much pressure in the lower tunnel. Oh, oh, my God. They get completely dumpstered. 
Glaive kills Dupree. Oh, he was so blind, and he just shot Dupree in the head. I didn't even realize that. That was all the push off of Cat. And then as Ziwoo continues to tear them up with this op, we've got Shocks setting up shop down in the depths of suicide. You're kidding. Vitality coming in from all angles. This was a position where if Shocks it doesn't win his duel, which he probably shouldn't, then you get a read here from Magus. Ooh, RPK peeks out. Device misses the shot in Zipix. He's going to get him through the doorway. We've got Astralis with a man advantage, but it's taken immediately back by Ziwu. Who looks like he wants a little more. Device, he's going to opt down a player, but Ziwu does not miss. Not shots like that. Double Molotov, double smoke for the execute, but while they wait, it's going to be Apex to get aggressive, and he wins a crucial duel versus Magisk. An additional smoke to make Ziwu a little awkward. He lets the first one slip, takes down the second, and then swaps to the P250. Can't quite get the job done, but recovers before Zipix sees a thing. And Vitality. Pockets, Apex, 10 grand. Oh, we've only got one round win? Yeah. Oh my god, it's one rifle round win. But gaining that little bit of map control, it could help. Magisk, his pistol, his deagle has been strong in this series, and he looks for another head, misses the chance, but the bomb plant can come through. Device on that scout. If they were to extend into the ramp, then maybe they could grab some guns back, but that would be to take a massive risk. Instead, they've allowed Nevera to slip up from CT spawn. Magisk, a little more damage. Zipix, he's going to get a deagle headshot. This could be the round. Astralis, they need the anomaly. And sure enough, the kills continue to come in. But Nevera, he gets sidelined by Device. Are they stalling out in the tunnels? Oh! Nevera, he's going to land a second shot. And Shocks, he sits on flat. Nice headshot. Pops up, takes Magisk down, goes for another. Op shot rings out, and check out these CTs. They're stuck. Scrambling over. They can't even do anything from the tunnels. They're so afraid to make progress. The, the incendiary comes out, and it goes so deep. One lands in their face. And this could be Vitality instantly tying up the game. Four to three. They're still all here corralled oh, in the tunnels. That's big. They get the headshot onto the plat player, Apex, he's tucked into the car, and the other CT's now smoked off. This has to be Apex to hold, and he gets the first one. Device still up close, window peak, slays Device, and now it's on to Zipix. One versus three, and RPK's gonna take him. Vitality to the pit. RPK to here to cover him in the crossfire. Three here to fight. More flashes, more frags, everything going well here. Vitality about to take the lead. They got the fight stranded. No kills come through for Astralis. They try to clash on long A, and the only reason they can afford this round is because they won previously with pistols. Not a single Last room for them to stand out from the rest. It's where Vitality can really show what they can do again on their CT side. They'll go for a long one more time. Oh, blind! Couldn't see a damn thing, and Magnus finds the kill. Nevera, so gracious to his opponent, puts back his gun. But leave the device here to cross up Cat. Bomb wanted to come in for the refrag. Dupree answers back, and Zewu's trying to figure out where it's all happening. And Astralis closed this distance as Nevera comes in from behind. He swapped over to the M4, and he has everything to do. Two of the three T's tagged, and Nevera gets the first one. Zipix comes off of the bomb plant. Oh, there's the peak, and there's the 14th. Astralis keep the game going. Well, okay. Damage, now he's starting to scramble. He's a little, a little scared, and he should be. Glaive turning his attention. Apex comes out from the window, only gets the one. Punch. Nevera on the CT box. Man advantage. Ziwu, he's yet. able to catch Zipix, and he's looking for more with Dupree still hiding behind these boxes. Ziwu's gonna miss the shot. Astralis man advantage. Somebody's taking a 15th round, and if it's not Nevera, then it's Astralis. They've got it. One round to get the and they know they can outlast them in a round that has to do with map control or nades. Apex is sussing out an aggressive option. He sees Glaive trying to They're flash charge. him out mid. Novera gets spotted on the double stack. He flashes it off of the car. Ziwoo missing the op shot. Again, three rounds in a row where the pressure's on him. Double flank through tunnel. Oh, and he gets stomped. Device with the headshot. Ziwoo with the flick, but he burns to Magisk. And now we've got RPK and Apex. Single smoke between them. Device locking it down, but RPK, he gets the two. And it's almost a third, but a strong. Will take us.